it seem like we feel the same We love what we hate going to do when you're facing the great opposition of your life right now hello guys this is shunten each and every one of us have oppositions to face every now and then we don't like it it's hard it's uncomfortable but it cannot be avoided that every day we have some challenges and opposition we are going to face how can we face those things i am just sharing this with you based on my experiences and of course how i survive all these things when we are experiencing oppositions. Yes, oppositions cannot be avoided as long as we meet different kinds of people every day. Remember, not everyone will like us. Not everyone can accept us. And not everyone will be for us. What you are going to do when you're facing the great opposition in your life. Me, I need to be silent. I need to listen to my inner feelings. I need to tell myself, it's okay, I can manage it. It's okay, this thing shall pass. It's okay, stand firm, you are not alone. That's what I am telling to myself when I am facing the great, great opposition in our day-to-day -day life. Yes, we live in a world with full of challenges. Challenges comes and goes and it cannot be avoided that every now and then we have to face it whether we like it or not. It seems so heavy. It seems so difficult. It seems there's no way you have to go through it. When I am facing the great opposition in my life, all I have to do is to call on to God. By that, I will not feel alone. I am not talking about religion here. I am only sharing with you how I survive life. Because I'm alone in this foreign country in many years and life has never been easy. Yes, the opposition will be there whether we like it or not but the key here is we must learn how to face it in a right way how to do something with it in a right way how to control ourselves and how to be humble even it seems so difficult Yes, the key here that you must learn to see humble. You must learn and understand that this thing will be just passing by. It's not easy, especially when you have nobody to talk to. But I am telling you many times that we are not alone in this life journey if you believe in god if you believe in buddha if you believe in allah then take it with you take it with you in that certain moment that you are not facing the opposition right now alone think right away that you are not alone for me i have my spiritual practice that god is with me always that is the word 
coming out into my mouth every day. So if you have the Allah, if you have the Buddha, what you ever you call it, call them. They are there for you. It is about your belief that you are not alone with your feelings. You are not alone with your heartaches. You are not alone with this huge opposition you are facing in your life right now. So for me, when I am facing this opposition, and you know we are always at work. And at work, it's not always easy to have time for yourself. So what I am doing when challenges comes at work that it seems so very difficult, it seems I cannot take it, I have to take a break, I have to go out of the building or else I have to go and sit down in the toilet meditating the goodness of God, meditating that God is with me always I can't take it because the secret here is to find your strength to find your inner power and get that out of you and use that at that certain moment you are facing a huge opposition in your life believe that there is something for you Someone will be always there for you if you only believe. Yes, believe and have faith in whom or what you are praying for. With that moment, I have to sit down there thinking the promises He has promised us. Well, I have the memory verse from the scriptures which I have verbalized it every day, the Jeremiah 33.3 because it says they call unto me and I will answer thee and I will show thee great and mighty things in your life that you don't know. Thou knowest not so it says there so i have to use that verse in order for me to do that feel alone in order for me to believe that i have someone up there i can call calling your someone who you believe in who you have faith in call that when you are facing that great opposition in your life. I know it's not easy. Again, we're going back again about your belief, about what you are thinking, what you are believing. But, but as what I told you, that we are not alone. So therefore, I don't like to feel alone when I am facing that great opposition in the day even I'm work or at home or wherever I am I have to call him you have to recognize what you are believing you have to recognize the spirit or what is that you are thinking or believing for because when you know that you are not alone you feel safe and secure that whatsoever is happening in your life how big how huge the opposition will be you can conquer that when you fail that you are not alone when you feel that to someone is working for you someone will be there for you someone will stand firm for you through thick and thin so therefore you have to find that belief in you what you are believing for what you stand for what is your spiritual practice every day that can help you when you're facing that huge opposition in your life we cannot stop the opposition remember that but all we have to ask is 
God will provide us the grace to be strong, the grace to be patient, the grace to keep on moving despite of this huge opposition which we are facing right now. And you have that when you can call upon Him. He said in Jeremiah, call upon me and I will answer thee. So I believe that when I can call Him, I feel safe and secure that whatsoever I am facing opposition in this right time, I believe that He is there for me. But you have to verbalize that. You have to communicate with Him every day. You have to acknowledge that thing. Or for me, I acknowledge God, which I am calling when I needed Him the most. So it is the same for you. Call someone. Call someone which you believe for, you have faith for, to be there to support you through thick and thin. This is just a reminder how I handle things when it thick so difficult. When it takes time to solve the problem, I must have someone to call on when I face that huge opposition in my life. This is Yundel. Thank you for listening. Thank you for dropping here in my channel. I am very grateful to each and every one of you supporting me here in my life journey. I love you all and Like we feel the same, we love what we have.